What's up guys, welcome to Top Form for you. In today's video, I've got the Xiaomi Mi 11 and uh, I'm gonna show you how you can uh, use the latest Mi Flash Unlock tool to uh, unlock your bootloader. But first, you have to make sure you have a, a Mi account set up with a, a phone number because you're gonna need to use the SIM card uh, um, register with the uh, Mi account to uh, log into this phone before you can unlock it. And uh, once you have your SIM card uh, inserted on the phone, you have to go into the settings and then sign in to your me account once you go to sign in you can either sign in with your mobile phone number or sign in with the username and password so I'm just gonna put my username there once you put your username and password just to sign in And then it will ask you to verify the account which is first next you just need to uh, take phone number or email and then just do next and then send it will send you a text to uh, verify your account okay. Then submit, continue, then and now. So uh, that's it. Now your me account is uh, linked to the phone. You need to go uh, onto the settings again, my device, and then you need to put the phone into developer option. You need to put the phone in developer mode by uh, just uh, keep tapping on the MIUI version until uh, you enable developer mode. There you go, it will say it in there. And then now go back, go back again, and then go into uh, additional settings. And go down, you see developer option there. You just uh, tap on it and from here you need to enable OEM unlocking and then uh, just keep going down and then enable USB debugging you have to wait five seconds and then accept next you have to link uh, you have to go onto the setting first and then turn off the Wi-Fi in order to uh, link it to the me unlock account so you just tap on, on me unlock status and then add account you have to do this uh, over 4g or using the data uh, on your sim card it won't work if you have wi-fi enabled it won't work so you have to make sure you have a, a data sim card enabled and your wi-fi is not connected and then you can just uh, click on add account to this device and then just give it a few seconds and then we go there you see you add it successfully so uh, next step you need to connect to the pc and then uh, download the me un uh, flash unlock once you go to your pc you just uh, open uh, your browser you can use chrome or firefox or um, edge then just go on to google.com and then here just search for me unlock and then you just uh, click on where it says uh, apply for me unlock permission and then you need to click on download me unlock and that will download the me the latest uh, me flash unlock for you so uh, the next step um, you need to uh, open the me unlock folder and then the app you're gonna need to run is that batch underscore unlock exe that's what you're gonna do but first we need to put uh, the phone into fastboot mode so just to switch off the phone Press the volume down while you're powering on. 
there you go and now you're in fastboot mode and then uh, wait until uh, windows will install all the driver for you once uh, everything is uh, installed and you have uh, all the driver installed uh, you just need to run this just double click on that and then your phone will show there if your phone doesn't show in here saying lock you just need to make sure it has the latest driver download the adb driver and come back here to make sure your phone shows before you proceed to the next step so in here you need to sign in to your me account just put the same me account you put on your phone now the account is logged in so uh, all you need to do just uh, you press f6 or click on unlock which will uh, unlock your device so I'm just going to click on uh, unlock now and uh, when you get that error or that warning to wait uh, 168 days it will tell you there please unlock 168 days later and do not remove your me account uh, because once you remove you will have to start the whole thing again one week later okay welcome back uh, so uh, it has been more than uh, seven days since we last uh, requested to unlock the bootloader on this uh, xiaomi mi 11 so uh, i'm just gonna rerun the batch unlock again and uh, proceed to the unlock uh, of the phone so just double click on that batch unlock now i'm just gonna plug in the phone uh, using the usb cable And uh, now I'm just going to put the phone into uh, fastboot mode by pressing the volume down and then uh, power at the same time. Okay, once the phone is in fastboot mode, it will show there with the lock status as uh, locked. Before you proceed to the next step, please make sure you back up all your files from the phone uh, because it will be factory reset and everything will be deleted. Okay, everything is uh, all set. So uh, the next step, I'm just going to click on uh, unlock or press F6 on your keyboard. Okay, the phone has restarted which means uh, the phone should now be unlocked but the first uh, boot up uh, takes uh, a few minutes so uh, just uh, you have to wait until the it comes on and then I'll take you through the initial setup. And once the phone has rebooted, you can uh, close the unlock tool and then uh, proceed uh, with the phone. Okay, now the phone is back on. So first we need to connect the phone to the Wi-Fi before we can proceed. So just click on the second button. Eh? And then uh, connect it to the Wi-Fi. Once you put your Wi-Fi password, just to connect. And now it's connected, just go back. And then uh, tap the first button on the top, which will ask you to put your me account password. So just type in your me account password there. And then next. Okay, I'm just going to proceed with the initial setup. There you go, and uh, the phone is now back on. So to double check to make sure the phone uh, bootloader has been unlocked, you just need to go to the settings and then go to my device. You have to enable the developer uh, mode again. So all specs and then keep tap on the MIUI version. And then now you're in the developer mode. So just go back, back again, and then go to additional settings. And then at the bottom you'll see the developer option and then if you look at the me unlock status you say your phone has been unlocked 
So uh, that's how you use uh, the latest in me unlock tool to uh, unlock your bootloader. So uh, that's it from me. Uh, if you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up uh, to help us out. And uh, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and enable notification for my latest video. Thank you for watching. Stay safe and I'll see you on the next one.